know it's you know bad you know lose a brother you know a true brother you know uh you know we came in together same class and everything but you know just that I mean we had to step up you know and uh you know take you know pick it pick up the slack and, you know get it going coach Meyer said you guys have been playing I mean there's been you guys have been together following the injury how would you describe the yeah. team as a whole after everything happened I mean, you know, just one of those things where you see something happen, you know, you, something like as one, you have to pick it up and go. Move forward, you know, uh, still get to our goal. He said he's never uh, seen Braxton like that after the injury, just right. how much pain he was. I mean, what was the immediate yeah. reaction with you guys? I mean, you know, we all just sat around like, oh, what's going on? Because, you know, Braxton's a warrior. You know, we don't, he doesn't do that. So we knew it was serious, and uh, it was just something that kind of shocked us all, but, you know, we picking it up and you know gonna get it going. So many expectations on this team uh, now with this this coming out. What would you say in terms of the solidarity solidarity you guys have and and going against critics now who might point to that as? I mean we don't worry about that. I mean the, the, I mean expectations still the same. We're Ohio State Buckeyes. And, you know we're gonna move forward and get it going. What have you seen from JT just being against him in camp and being against him through the summer and fall? What have you seen from him? Uh, he's a JT is a really smart, precise guy. You know, he he really pays attention to detail. You can tell by the way he's been playing, and uh, I'm, I have a lot of confidence in him. He's been playing very well. People keep talking about him as a leader. Yeah, he's a young player though. Yeah. Has, has he stepped up? You know, in this. In yeah. This one of the things. One of the things about JT Barrett is last year when we came as a true freshman. Uh, I don't think a lot of guys noticed he was a part of the leadership committee as a true freshman. And he was the third, fourth, fourth quarterback on the depth chart. Uh, a lot of people don't know that because he just has those leadership qualities. And uh, it's showing on the field. What have you noticed in him, even this last 24, 48 hours, in terms uh -huh. of that leadership, kind of like specific examples on and off the field that he's really taking command more so than he did before? Um, just controlling everything, you know, pointing out, you know, you know, being very verbal, talking, you know, controlling everybody. You know, if a veteran me me might mess up a route here, go talk to him. Like, hey, we got to do this, we got to do that. Like, he's been in there. And uh, that's what we need to see from him. That's what he's been doing. Duran, does this in some way, strange way, even motivate you even more? I mean, yeah. You, it like, really does for me. It really does for me personally because you know Braxton's a true brother to me. You know what I'm saying? We all came, like I said, we all came in together. Me, Curtis, Ryan, Jeff, uh, Steve. You know, we all the class of 2011. We we're very tight knit group. So you know, it hit me. It hit me pretty hard. But you know, we got to step it up. We have to. Last year, Kenny Guyton had to come in when Braxton got injured. Does that right. give you guys confidence too, knowing you've had a backup quarterback come in and you've right. been able to be successful? Right. Uh, we're knowing with JT, he does what K KG does. You know, take those mental reps, and he had a lot of. He has a lot of. Uh, he's have had a lot of uh, competitive reps this fall, and uh, been looking pretty good. What is it that he does well when you guys play against him? Um, coach said he's got like 300 competitive throws against yeah. you guys. And yeah. What does he do well? Uh, it's just smart decisions. Uh, makes the hard throws. Makes the easy throws. Control the offense. Uh, he controls the huddle, and you can tell even when they're speeding it up. He has everything controlled. Everybody's getting set. And it's goal time. You know, he's, no, he's no Braxton Miller, obviously, but you know everybody's different. Mm -hmm. But but you guys have confidence in this kid. Oh yes, for sure. I have 100 percent confidence. Because it's the leadership qualities that he shows every day. Like I said before, I mean, he was a he was on our leadership committee as a true freshman last year, and uh, like he was the only one, and nobody really could. No, I don't know if I knew that, but I mean, he just have those natural leadership abilities. How will the offense? You've seen them operate with with JT and also right. with Cord Cord Cordell. Yeah. How will the offense? You think be a little different? I mean, it might be a little different. How? You I mean, say. will it? You know, will it? Will it? Will there actually be different sort of like play packages, et cetera? I mean, no, I mean, same playbook from what yeah, I've been seeing. Yeah. He's just been making the throws. The throws we need him to uh, make, and he's been making. Them. That's why the confidence is there. And and when you say that, I mean, are they? Is he really distributing the ball around the field? I mean, <laughs> talk about what it's you're saying. It's funny that you that say that because Coach makes like the distributor. That's his name. I like and I, I kind of took to it. They call him the distributor. That's a good name for him because he's he's doing what he has to do. The other corner job, I know Urban said that that's still up for job up, up for grabs. Yeah. Opposite you, a lot of guys fighting for that job. Has yeah. anybody kind of stepped up there? Um, it's just a lot of guys are playing hard for that spot. You know, I mean, we got Eli Apples there, Armani Reeves is obviously there, Gary on Conley, even Damon Webb stepped up big time. I mean, it's just. It's a good, confident group. I love that's my unit, and I take a lot of pride in that unit. And uh, I'm just excited to see whoever gets it. Could they rotate a little bit? I know that's probably not ideal. You probably want one it guy to step be, up. It could, could be possible. Yeah, it could be possible.